Hello out there, YouTube. What's going on, guys? It is D Dunn here, the most chill COD player, over here commentating on the gaming VOD on another episode of the series for Kim Strike with Every Gun. The gun that we are going to be talking about and watching today is the MSBS. Now, this Kim Strike is pretty fast. I cut out the the uh, the the round switch uh, in Blitz, so we don't have a whole ton of time to talk. So let's go ahead and uh and get right into the gun so the msbs when it first came out it was basically the type 95 from modern warfare 3 super op everyone used it then they nerfed the living crap out of it then they buffed it again i think now i would say it's pretty balanced uh basically what they did was is they just um first of all they reduced the rate of fire um and the damage and then when they buffed it i think they gave it a little bit of damage buff i think and uh made it the burst you could burst faster so i think it's pretty balanced now it's all right um good attributes of this gun has pretty good range um it has a uh, really good fire rate it's pretty spammable now um you can if you have a decent trigger finger you can uh, you can get some shots down um it's a one shot kill from a pretty far distance away uh especially with a muzzle break and the silencer isn't too bad the only problem that i have with this gun uh is that the iron sights are complete crap and believe it or not, even though most people associate with th three-round burst guns with having virtually no recoil at any sort of distance, or if your enemy is prone, uh, you will actually, in my opinion, have a somewhat hard time finding yourself getting those one-shot kills because there's just enough vertical kick um, to overshoot your target at, like I said, a long range or if they're prone. So, uh, class recommendations. What I would say is uh, if you're going to run it unsilenced, I would recommend that you do uh, grip and red dot. If you can stand the iron sights, I recommend then that you would run grip and uh, muscle break. Also, it's uh, worth noting that if you don't have really, really good aim, something that will help you with this gun is to not use stalker. Because if you're strafing left or right and you don't have very good aim, it's going to be hard for you to get all three uh, bullets from your burst on target. Uh, so what I would recommend is taking off stalker. Like I said, if you don't have very good aim, you'll find that you're going to hit all bullets in your burst, uh, more frequently, which will result in more, uh, one burst kills. Uh, if you are going to run a silencer, um, what I prefer is running a uh, grip and silencer. Uh, once again, just that recoil will really kill you, especially when you have to hit multiple, multiple bursts using a silencer. Previously, uh, my personal experience with this, I'd always want run it with a red dot and grip or a red dot muzzle break. But unfortunately, I'm not as good as uh, as the person playing in this game, so I'm not able to get game strikes on silence. At least I only have a couple. So um, I tend to run a silencer, and I ran it with uh, silencer and grip first game that I ran. That combination, I managed to get a 40 gun streak, which I know isn't great, but maybe you guys can get one too. And that's all I really can say about the MSBS. If you guys have anything to add, uh, make sure to leave your comment down in the section below. Um, also, question of the day, what do you think is the best three-round burst gun in Call of Duty history? I know the FAMAS is going to be up there from NW2, maybe the COD4 M16. For me... I would have to say, honestly, it's the Type 95 uh, because you can put rapid fire on that thing and absolutely destroy. To me, that was my favorite uh, burst gun. Once again, Modern Warfare 3, uh, Type 95 with red dot and rapid fire. That was the way I like to run it. Anyway, guys, that's all I got for you guys today. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like. If you hated it, well, then just go ahead and dislike it. Make sure to check out all links below in the description. Check out my channel. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.